Hello and welcome. This is Sahara playing Dragon Age 2, the or the Ultimate Edition. We are in Chateau Han and we are sneaking around. Something totally different. Okay. We have a couple of abilities down here. We can knock guards out. Took a little bit to figure that out. And then we also have distract by throwing a stone. Where does this go? Oops, get back over here. Get back over here. Get back over here. Oh, we got two guards over here. I need to get to that door. Or this door. Oh, I guess it's down here. You didn't try the cheese, did you? Are you joking? It tests of despair. I'm not a madman. There's several doors. We're supposed to stay in the shadows as much as we can. I don't think I can do that. Oh, so I need a key. All right. So I have to get over there to get the key. Oops. Bust of the outlaw. How come this didn't show up before when it went by it? Hmm? Um, bearded beast, what in this, what in this fearsome besiege appeals to us? What virtue can this otherwise uncouth and generally suspect creature inform? Raw, fiercely bearded aggression, not so much carved as inflicted by the chisel. Common humor claims that whole figures are carved, then sundered to the bust, the, the limbs used to beat the form from the next Sculptor's block. Examples are common and deliberately crude. None claim to be an accurate representation of a specific person, and the name is irrelevant, often stolen from the fears of the day. So it is not... So... If it is not the honoring of a villain turned folk hero, what is left to discern? What does this say about the... the manners to of court? that beneath it, beneath is an, is an um, epic, uh, affection for such unfeathered and brutal images of strength. What is hidden by this bearer, or by this beard? Okay, musings on a form, the beast, as collected by, oh, whatever. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so we have to get in over here. But there are guards wandering around. Come on. Is there a guard right here? Oh, there's a guard right there. Okay. And there's a guard there. And here he comes. Okay, so there doesn't, there isn't a way to get in over here. Okay, let's go over here then. On. Not going to happen. Oh, none of these doors. I can open none of these doors. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
which means I gotta figure out a way to distract them. Distract them or knock them out. You're making this more difficult than it has to be. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, I didn't know he was there. It's not easy. This isn't easy. Come on, move. So there's one. Oh, okay. Okay, here comes the other guard. Oh boy, I'm not liking this. Mm-mm. No, I'm not. So I'm gonna have to knock one of them out. I must be hearing things. Okay. I couldn't search. I was in this armor. A man's gonna pass out. That's my bloody story. All right, I was able to get in this one. Come on, get in there. Come this way. All right. Do I have a key? I do. I have a key. Anxiety. Hmm. That was a restriction to who? To me? Anxiety. Uh, yeah, Corinne. To me. Bonus for complete item set. So there's a set called Anxiety? <laughs> oh. And Skepticism. Hmm. Critical chance bonus to lock picking. Enemies drop more coin. All right, look. This is a five star. It's also five star. Hmm. Okay, so now we gotta go back around to get over here to unlock that. You know that they walk around in the... No harm done. Okay, at least he's saving. So... So he must be... Okay, there he is. Okay. Where am I trying to get to? An armor stand would serve with more distinction than you, maggots! These men will guard the body, but you will not be sipping footy drinks and midling! This is war! These heartless slaves to fashion would wear your skin as a cravat if they could. Never forget that. Every one of you will be prepared for battle. Do not relax for an instant. Okay.
so I need to get to where... I thought I saw something red. That should do it. Okay. That got me there. And then I need to go around to the other side. Right? Yep, this is where I need to be. This that door wouldn't let me in. Okay. Ugh. You drop the pie. I'm sorry, monsieur. It's all squashed and one of the hounds took a bite of it. It's really not that bad. Just put it back on the plate and cover it up with some gravy. <laughs> okay, whatever. Okay, now where do I need to go? I need to go over here. Boy, this thing is huge. And then another door. This was just to get all the way around this stupid thing. There's the banquet hall. Another door. Is anyone going to notice all these doors are open? Okay, so. Alright, so this is part of it right here. We have Stanimadrod here. A library of distinction. <clears throat> it was with no small flair that Duke Prosper de Montfort offered a home to the exalted Esme de Hol um, Julie's whatever considerable library of social graces, including the ever growing volumes of Corley Prominus, so carefully logged by the dedicated scholars of Her Majesty's intimate circle. It was an act of charity to a former enemy that, while earning a considerable influence, was no small expense of delivery. De Montfort downplayed these elements with customary charm, insisting that he accepted this burden with the increase in status firmly second among his considerations. It is an honor to be honored when literary lineage is the true benefactor. De Jolene can rest well knowing that I hold his treasured tombs where none shall harm or read them. If he is allowed to encroach upon Orlean territory at some distant time, perhaps he can petition to visit them. A library of distinction notes on the dispensing of the holdings of the disgraced Esmo de Jolie, collected and edited by whoever. Okay. Codex updated. All right, so here's the amulet. Where did the Duke get this? This was part of the Fog Warrior's amulet. Fenris has mentioned them. I never thought I'd see one. Okay, so that's part of it. It's not all of it. So I need to go... I need to go where? I need to go over here. Oh, up the stairs. Okay. You know we're gonna have a fight, right? I hope.
We're like not in the shuttles now. Okay. How do we get, so we gotta go up over here and over, it looks like, to get over here. Wow, what a maze. Is that you hiding over here? It is, isn't it? Okay. What's the matter? I don't want to talk about it. Let's simply find the jewel and be done with this. Uh, and she's lying to us, and I know she is. So, lady... Um, Devo arrived at the court of Emperor... Whatever. Not important. Okay. Oh, this is like a little library here. Is there something over here? No, it's just a picture. Okay. Might help you, you know, if you went a little bit faster. Portrait of the Dowager. The relations have me saying you must dance with the Dowager if you want to play the game. To a foreigner, this might sound like some sort of proverb. In fact, Dowager Lady Manella has been one of the most influential members of the Imperium Court for over 30 years, and nobody advances in the game without her favor. Yeah, the Orlesians do all these games. I mean, that's their whole thing is, you know, their statue. The rumors surrounding her are many. She was Emperor Florine's mistress. She was Florine's assassin. She placed pr em Empress Selina on the throne. She often killed a rival with only harsh words. She rules Orle from the shadows. One thing is certain, however, if you must have the best society in Orle, ask a dance of the Dowager. Hmm. Okay. I think there was another one over here. Pride and Rider, an image in oil of the last pure Anderfell stabled at court before the pic before the practice of mounted sports fell from favor. This is an absolutely iconic and typical example of the artist. The work preserves the true majesty, majesty of a species that, while in abundance on their natural plains, becomes exotic to a people who eschew mounted travel in their daily existence. An ambitious work often referred to as Pride in Rider, it is part of a series of similarly themed canvases which, for, less, for reasons known only to the creator, were labeled, were labeled and went the Griffin auction notes from the works of well we ride horses here I don't know they must not ride horses here there here in this land okay so I gotta go through this door more sneaking quickly over here quickly over here where well you're not in the you're in light now okay So those are flowers, so I need to go up. I see a chest. He's all walking around. Okay, we have a guard. Um, can I sneak up on you and then hit you? What was that scrabbling noise? Okay. Uh oh, uh oh. Um. Didn't see anything. Bugger Prosper's vault if someone got past. You're making this more difficult than it has to be. Yeah, I knew I was going to get seen there. Okay. So. Is 
So I've got guards up here. Oh, two guards. All right, how do I get past them? All right. Okay, I think I'm supposed to knock him out and then throw a stone, but I'm just not fast enough to do this without getting caught. Cursed rats. Your making no. is more difficult than it has to be. Oh, Careful. Yeah. We don't want to bring the Duke's entire army down on us. I don't see you doing anything, bitch. Um... I can't go over there. I mean, I could maybe, but he, I think he's going to see me because I won't be disguised. What was that scrabbling noise? No harm done. What? I just, I just hit him. Someone's here. You're making oh. this more difficult than it has to be. Uh, not liking this. Is someone's here? So Are oh. you trying to get caught on purpose? I can't do them back to back. That's the problem. Um, Cause he's not gonna be out for long. What was that scrabbling noise? Oh, Jesus! Than it has to be. If you don't hit him right, if you don't get him right away in the right place, oh god, I'm about ready to just give up on this one. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got this far. I got this far. All right. I can't get in this door. And I believe this is the door I need to get into. It is. So somebody's got to have a key. Which means I have to knock somebody out. Unless there's a chest over here. Cursed rats. There is a chest over here. But it doesn't have what I wanted in it. So one of them has to have a key. I saved okay I did save so I'm gonna go back to that save um, I did a save 
Mm-hmm. Um, nope, this is not the save I had. I saved when I got past this. Hmm. All right. All right, so I think I've got some of this figured out. I found out where the balcony key is at anyway. Oh, wow, this is just not fun. Okay, then you gotta sneak along here. I'm gonna move, move, move. You sneak along here. Then you wait. Damn blackouts keeping me off patrol. Come over here and sneak. He is the one with the um he's the one. No, he's the one with the key. So, need to distract him. Cursed rats. Oh, he doesn't have the key. I thought he did. Oh, he's the one with the key. Yeah, the, oh, okay. I should have realized because you can, he's highlighted. Well, they all are highlighted. Damn blackouts, keeping me off patrol. Okay. So I need to distract him. Oh, the wrong one went over there. Now I gotta wait for the cooldown. Now I gotta wait for the cooldown. Okay. I must be hearing things. Well, one of them had the key. Um, one of them had the key. Oh, my head. What was that about? No, oh, damn it. It's more difficult than it has to be. Oh. I wonder if I have the key, because I've done this so many times. <laughs> but I know I had the key. It was on one of the guards. Cursed rats. It wasn't on him. It's not on any of these two, because I haven't so even touched them. Because that's the door I need to get into. Not it off, I suppose. Hit the floor hard enough. I think there's a chest over there on this side, though, too. There's, um, did they change their pattern? Looks like they might have. Cursed rats. All right, that's that guy. Done. 
Oh, I do have the key now. Let's move. Yep, somehow or another I ended up with the key even though... <sighs> hmm. Some kind of inconsistency with the game, I'm thinking. Hmm? Okay, so she's all the way down here. We got a chest. This is it. Raven feather. The vault. Okay, so that's what this is, it's the vault. <clears throat> of course! It's never as easy as it seems, is it? I swear I didn't know. There must be some sort of switch. <laughs> switch party members, Hawk and Talus must activate the four switches in this room simultaneously to progress. Left click on a character's portrait or left click on the character. <clears throat> okay. Simultaneously, how do you do that? So how do you do it add together at the same time? Hmm. Hum. Oops, wait a minute here. It's not letting me just be able to select them. You could be able to select them with your mouse before. No, it's not. Okay, here we go. No, it didn't let me do it. Okay. Oh, well, they both kind of move together. Okay. All right. They can only be... All right, so... You here. You here. Well, how come they're not going at the same time? Okay. Maybe I'm too far apart. Or too far away. Uh, so let's go here. Let's go here. She's not going at the same time. That's the problem. Okay. All right. I think I need on. I think I know what I need to do. I think I know what I need to do. Okay. 
I can do this fast enough. I, it's making you use your keys. Okay, so... No, 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 no. That's what it is. Okay. So... Oh, damn it. <clears throat> How do you do it slow? That's the whole thing. Um... No, that that's her. And then her. Is this going to work? I doubt it. See, she keeps wanting to go up to the side. I don't... Mm. Okay. isn't going to work. She keeps wanting to go up to the side. Okay, so for me to do this, there's just no way it's going to work. Like, almost got it figured out there. Except she didn't. Okay. Is this going to be it? Is this going to be it? Oh, it was so close. Right? Oops. Oh my god, these games. Oh, she was just so close, right there. You just never know where she's going to end up at. See, look at this. Now she's not in the right formation. Now she didn't move. She didn't move at all that time. Ugh. Okay. But they're both on there now, right? 
So did I already open it and I didn't realize it? Did I? I don't know. Okay, well how do we get... Okay, I guess I'm not understanding that, so... I did open them. But how do... How do we both get through it then? I was thinking it was these here that opened up. I didn't realize it was the side ones. Duh. Nope, that didn't do it. So one of them has to stay on there while the other one... All right, I'm on. This makes me mad now that I did have it and I didn't realize I did. Nope. Oh my god. Okay, they're open now. So... So one stays on. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. Did that open any? So what did that do? Did that keep this one open? Yes, it did. Okay. Okay, so that one's open. That one is closed. Oh, nope. Oh, I feel like I'm a mouse. I feel like I'm a mouse. What is this? Okay. Oh, she not she kept it on. All right, I see what she did. All right. All right, so she's doing the same thing. Okay, so now they should stay open, right? Is that what it is all about? So are we able to get out of here? Okay, there's more, there's more of them, of course. Okay. So now that's open, but how do we get into these? Okay. What's in here? Something wrong. I don't know. Yes. Don't fret, my dear. And now we have our weapons. Yes, this qualifies as wrong. It's not over yet. But it is over. I knew who you were the moment you arrived. 
Assassin. Assassin? I knew it. You did? You've been acting strangely ever since we arrived. Clever girl. Have you also deduced that your elven friend is Kunari? She what? I mean you'd be Kunari. You're Kunari? It's complicated. You're Kunari. Um it's yeah. complicated. I assume you'll let me go, then. Yes, you were only here to rob me. Much better. Look, I came to stop the heart from doing something we will all regret. She didn't. Leave her out of this. And waste all the effort I spent luring you here before the heart's arrival? Don't be foolish. Asse hasatra mas. Mas avas trasukulun. Take them away. Really? Bitch? I didn't like you. I didn't like you. Where's Barney? I want my Barney. The elf was Kunari. Yeah. And the dwarf has no beard. I know it made no sense to me either. Maybe they cut her horns off. The Kunari are not a race. They are a religion. What I don't understand is why a Kunari agent would try to kill one of her own people. And why involve the champion? Excellent questions. I expect answers to match. I live to please. Okay. So, at least we're not dead. I don't suppose an apology would make things better? No. Um... You wouldn't. There's nothing you can say. Nope. I'm sorry I used you to help the people that attacked your home. I'm sorry for getting you captured and perhaps killed. That kind of apology? When you put it that way, it sounds so terrible. It is terrible. Yep. I am sorry. This didn't work out like I'd planned. Obviously. What was your plan, exactly? The one I expected to find is named Salit, a member of the Ben Hasrath, the heart of the Menning. I was told he's here to sell secrets to the Orlesians, and I came to stop him. I... Suppose I was misinformed. Obviously. So you came here to stop this elite from betraying your people? You probably won't believe me, but this isn't a political mission. It's... personal. Personal? What do you mean? Salit was my best Rathari, the one who recruited me into the Ben Hasrath. My tutor. He's the one who saw my potential, convinced me that I could make a difference. It doesn't matter now. But you said he was selling secrets. He is. Or at least he intends to. One last act of defiance. I can't let him do that. Not when he'll hurt so many others in the process. You mean he'll hurt other Kunari? Not every Kunari is a soldier, you know. There are tens of thousands of farmers, artisans, craftsmen. People who have never hurt anyone. People whose only crime is living. They don't deserve what he's going to do to them. But it's more than my duty to stop Salit. It is my moral obligation. Is it really? Hmm. You mentioned the heart of the many before, but you said it was the name of the jewel. It's also what Ben Hasrith means. Some people say we're enforcers that keep the Kunari in line, but that's not it. It's hard to explain. Try. We're the soul of the Kune. We keep its spirit alive and protect it from both outside and from within. Not every Kunari agrees, nor do they always do what is best for all. The Ben Hasrith remind us of our common goal. Hmm. Oops. A common goal being subjugation. It's not always meant to end in violence. There are other paths. They do not all need to lead to the same destination. No, not from one we've seen. I probably don't sound very convincing. So you're... 
The way you're talking, it sounds like you're one of these Van Hasraf. I am, or I was. Whether I ever am again, I guess that remains to be seen. Is that why you're here? To redeem yourself? Not to them. Doubt is the path one walks to reach faith. To leave the path is to embrace blindness and abandon hope. Another Kunari proverb? She who swallows wisdom in tiny chunks avoids choking. Hmm. So did you really involve me just because I had an invitation? You were the only one on the invitation list who wasn't a personal friend of the Montfort family. And you're also the champion of Kirkwall, and a Ferelden with no reason to love or lay. And then what, And yeah. what was going to happen when all this was over? I thank you, we go our separate ways. Really? I wouldn't notice a thing? Truth? You're... not exactly what I was expecting. I've heard a few stories about you. They don't quite do you justice. Perhaps if I'd done my homework, I would have known more about you. Given you the respect you deserve. Nothing I could do about it now. Hmm. So who are you, really? So everything you told me was a lie? Not everything. So I just missed the part where you're one of the people I drove out of Kirkwall. You don't need horns to embrace the Kuhn. What you need is a purpose. A belief in unity, in improving the lot, not only for your own people, but for everyone. You mean brainwash everyone? Um... You're talking about butchers, out to destroy any sense of free will. Yep. I'm talking about fighting to make things better. By slaughtering anyone who disagrees with you. Because your people are so much better, I suppose? No one oppressed? No one left starving? Being Kunari doesn't automatically mean you're a zealot. Most Kunari don't even understand humans, why you act like you do. But I grew up among you. I understand perfectly well. Hmm. Wait, aren't you here to kill someone for the Kunari? I never said I was killing him for the Kunari. So you're improving his lot? Perhaps repeatedly? I know it's not easy to understand. After what the Arishok did, I hardly blame you. But just tell me, can you honestly say there's nothing to improve, nothing to strive for? We believe in striving together. We may stumble, but that doesn't mean we shouldn't try. Yeah, but you're talking about everyone believing exactly the same thing. Mm-mm. You're wrong. Sounds like an excuse for tyranny. Yep. It's who I am. I joined the Ben Hasras because I felt it meant something. Because you didn't have any it meaning in your something. own life. Yeah, because you didn't have any meaning in your own life. Mm. You sound like you're trying to convince yourself. Yep. It's been a long time since I talked to anyone about it. I suppose it's not really a prison cell conversation. Hmm. I assume you have some sort of plan. I always have a plan. Do you? A good one? Oh, ye of little faith. <sighs> the first order of business is getting out of here before His Grace decides we would taste good in the soup. Or whatever he has planned. Any ideas? We didn't come here alone, remember? That's it. I'm taking the lead. You think I'm going to trust you to find Hawk? Could you stop with the all mages are evil diatribe for one minute? They may not all be evil, but one of them in particular is extremely annoying. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. I'm officially tired of waiting to be rescued. Why didn't you just do that before? You said your friends were coming. Thank the Maker. Are you all right, love? Let's go. So, back through the castle, then? There's a better way than fighting through the Duke's entire army. I'll show you. At least we managed to find your kit. Then we should head for the caves. That's the way out I planned to take Jack? us through, originally.
Okay, I think this is probably almost an hour, and it is. So I'm going to go ahead and close down this episode. The Ben Hashad. The oxmen do not kill their prisoners. The coon, the coon abhorts waste, and a person is a valuable commodity. Instead of death, we found ourselves housed in a labor camp run by the Ben Hash, Ben Hashad. They called us whatever simple ones. And this was where we were to be introduced into the Kuhn. Yeah, they brainwash everybody. Ah, uh, no. Unless you want to carve your way out through the Duke's... All right, heart of the mini. Tell us unlock the cell door. Time to escape, Duke's... Yeah. It's up to you which way you want to go, Hawk. I'll help you either way. I don't know. Funny. She didn't look brainwashed. I assume we get out first and deal with this Kunari later. Yeah, yep, that is what we do. So I'm going to go ahead and close down this episode. Uh, there's to the vaults. Do we want to go back to the vaults or not? Hmm. If you're enjoying, click like, leave a comment, subscribe, and thank you so much for watching. Sahara out.